Dick Cheney's on the warpath. He made these cutting comments about John McCain. Then he went on to Pelosi and Martha. And he says about their plan that, uh, that it would, uh, serve Al-Qaeda's purposes. And, it, quote, the Al-Qaeda strategy is to break the will of the American people, try to persuade us to throw in the towel and come home, and then they win because we quit. I think if we were to do what Speaker Pelosi and Congressman Murtha are suggesting, all we will do is validate the Al-Qaeda strategy. Now, uh, do I believe that that's true? Of course not. That's a ridiculous statement. It, factually, I think. But the reason I'm going to defend Dick Cheney is, I don't think it's an outrageous thing to say. If you say that the Democrats are not patriotic, or they don't have the best interests of the country at heart, I think that's a ridiculous thing to say. If you say the Democrats want the terrorists to win, I think that's a ridiculous thing to say. But I think to say the Democratic strategy is not a good one and that it will help our enemies, I don't think is outrageous. I don't think it is crazy. Because I think the Republican strategies help our enemies and wind up helping al-Qaeda. So I don't think there's anything wrong with saying that. That's a substantive issue that you have a disagreement over. I think Dick Cheney helps al-Qaeda every single day. He thinks Pelosi and Martha do. I mean, here's what helps al-Qaeda, for example, not going after their leaders. Osama bin Laden is well here. He's very comfortable in Pakistan. That literally and inarguably helps al-Qaeda because you promise you won't go after their leaders. You take absolutely no action against their leaders. In fact, instead of going after their leaders or even any of their fighters, you go and attack countries that have nothing to do with al-Qaeda, like Iraq and Iran. Iran's a Shiite country. They, they are sworn enemies of al-Qaeda. And now you're going to attack another country that is not only not with al-Qaeda, but fighting against al-Qaeda. So what does that do? It helps al-Qaeda. When we toppled the government of Iraq, that helped Iran, and that helped al-Qaeda. That it, I, I, It's nearly impossible to disagree with that. So I don't mind Cheney saying that uh, certain people help al-Qaeda with their strategies, not because they want to. I don't think Dick Cheney wants to help al-Qaeda. I don't think Dick Cheney's uh, unpatriotic. I, I don't, you know... I, he has a different idea. It's a grotesque idea. It's completely wrong. Uh, but his idea is, oh, we'll, you know, do, not that he wants to really attack al-Qaeda so much, because the proof is in the pudding. Obviously, Bush and Cheney don't want to go after bin Laden. They don't want to go after al-Qaeda, because they haven't. They've had six long years, and they haven't done it. I mean, when they had oh, bin Laden cornered in Tora Bora, they sent 36 troops after him. Not 3,600, not 36,000. 36. Yeah, and why didn't they send more? Because they were getting ready for Iraq.